Hello neighbors, it's Brad here at eTrailer, and today we're taking a look at the eTrailer SD tow bar for Blue Ox base plates on a 2021 Subaru Crosstrek. Now there are five required components when flat towing a vehicle. And the first one starting on the vehicle side is going to be the base plate. And the base plate attaches to the frame of the vehicle and that's gonna allow for all your connection points for your other components. Now, going along with that, you see our tow bar here is actually attached to that base plate, and that's gonna make that connection between the vehicle and the RV. Next, you have your safety chains, and that's gonna to attach to the loops on your base plate and also to the side of the camper. That way, if they do become disconnected for whatever reason, these chains are gonna hold this in place. Next, you have your braking system. Your braking system will allow the vehicle to slow and stop as you put those brakes on on the RV. Also included with that is gonna be this breakaway switch. So if all your components fail, this is gonna pull this cable, putting the brakes on the vehicle and bringing it to a stop so it's not rolling down the highway. Next, you have your diode wiring, and your diode wiring is gonna send the turn signals and brake lights and running lights from your RV to your vehicle. And this is all done based on this umbilical cord, which is gonna attach your six pole here that we have on our vehicle to the seven pole on the camper. Now this tow bar is specifically designed for Blue Ox base plates so you can tow your Subaru behind. Now this has a weight rating of 6,000 pounds, so that's really gonna open up the options if you plan on ever towing another vehicle that might weigh a little bit more. This has some really nice features and the fact that it is non-binding, so when you get to your campground and you wanna detach your vehicle, it's nice and easy and not having to find flat level ground in order to release these. Also included is the safety chains, which is really nice because you also have these little guides here that hold it in place. So it keeps everything nice and tight in this area so you don't have a bunch of things hanging down while you're driving. You also have this little arm, which is great to put your coiled up umbilical to keep this from dragging on the ground as well. Now, when you are ready to unhook your vehicle or if you're not using your base or your tow bar, it's gonna be really easy to disengage by taking your pin out sliding this, pushing this down to release. We'll do it on the other side here. And then from here, we can unhook. So then when you're ready to store your tow bar, pretty easy here, we're gonna just slide these over lift them both up make sure that they are lifted up you can see that pin down there you want that going right over that yellow and then as we drop down that'll keep those in place and when you're at the campground it's nice because this kind of folds out of the way keeping it from really being in the way of things or tripping over it and that's fine at the campsite but if you want to keep this looking good for a long time there's also covers available so that way if you aren't flat towing but you want to keep it on the back of your rv you can cover this up and it's going to protect it from the elements and that was a look at the e-trailer sd tow bar for blue ox base plates on a 2021 super cross track